This isn't a Dollarama bag, but we're gonna pretend because I didn't buy a bag when she asked me for one. So hey guys, in today's video, I had the idea of why not do a dollar pet store haul? You can get a ton of items for pets at the dollar store, ones that aren't specifically made for pets that can be used for your animals like hamsters and things like that. I have found quite a bit of goodies that I can use for my pets. So I thought I would show you guys what I got today. So the first thing that I got from Dollarama was these glass jars. I have already so many of these, but I needed more because I use these for my hamster's treats. Um, I always get questions, where do I get these? I get them from the dollar store because they are only $2.50. So they're pretty cheap. It comes with three and they're really pretty and cute. They just like store your treats really nicely. So I got those. The next thing that I picked up was I was looking for a sand bath kind of dish for honey. So I got her this, um, it's the shape of a seashell. So I got her this dish for her cage and I thought it was really cute. I was trying to find one that was more square, but I found this one and I thought it was a decent size. It's the same size as my head. So it is pretty nice. The next thing that I got was just a cat toy for my cat. Uh, it has these like little feathers on the bottom and Callie really likes playing with toys with feathers and stuff. So I thought I would try this out because it was, it was only $1.25 so I had nothing to lose. So I thought I would try that out with her. Then the next thing I got actually is meant for fragrances. Um, you put like the fragrance inside the top here, I think, and then this hole, you put like a tea light candle and the heat makes the smell go everywhere. But these are perfect hamster hideouts for um, dwarf hamsters. So I'm gonna be giving this to Tater Tot. And this is my one of my favorite colors. So I really, really love this. And I just thought it would be a cute little hideout for inside a hamster cage. The next thing that I picked up was a cat grass kit. So this you just put dirt and I think it comes with the seeds, I think it comes, well I hope it, I really hope it comes with the seeds, that would be very pointless. But it comes with like cat grass seeds, you put dirt in here, you put the lid on it and it grows cat grass for your cat, but you can also give it to your rabbits um, or hamsters as well. So it's a great way to give your rabbits like grass and you don't have to bring them outside. So I thought I would try this out. The next thing is I got another container. So this one was more square and taller. I don't know if you can see it that well because it is clear, but I thought this would be a good one for Bumble to use as his sand bath because he's always getting bedding in it. So I thought maybe if it had higher sides, it would be better for him. And then I could put more sand in here because he really enjoys digging in sand. So then the last thing that I got was for the rabbits and that is this nylon pet tent. So these I've seen for, they make these specifically for rabbits and I've seen them on Amazon. So they're kind of expensive and this was only $2.50. So I thought that was a good deal. It's just this red color and I think the rabbits will really like playing in this. Hopefully they don't pee in it for some reason. I've had them these before and they wanted to pee in it. So hopefully they don't pee in it. But I just thought it was a good price for this tent. So yeah guys, that is everything that I picked up from the dollar store. I highly recommend looking in your local dollar store, Dollar Tree, Dollarama, wherever. Um, <laughs> they have some really good supplies that you can use for your animals, especially for hamsters. Like a lot of the containers can be used for different things like sand baths and hideouts. So I really recommend looking there and you can save yourself quite a bit of money. So yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. Bye.